Hello and welcome to the channel. In this video, we are looking at one of the most important peripheral in any semiconductor memory circuit that is called as the sand amplifier. So we will also see the working of the sand amplifier using Cadence Virtuoso. So why sand amplifier is the most critical peripheral circuit because it is used to speed up the read operation of our semiconductor memory. Also, it significantly reduces the power consumption of our semiconductor memory. The most common type of sense amplifier is the latch type voltage sense amplifier because of its high sensing speed and low power consumption. So the sense amplifier main purpose is to reduce the power and speed up the operation. So this is the cross coupled voltage type of latch sense amplifier. So it is similar to our SRAM 6 uh, 6 transistor cell only thing is the M5 transistor or the tail transistor that you can see in the diagram. So it is uh, this is the only transistor that is the extra otherwise the circuit is very similar to the 6T type SRM cell. So now let us look at the complete circuit of uh, SRAM with pre-charge circuit also and the sense amplifier circuit also. So this is the complete circuit of the SRAM cell so uh, in the top you can see P1, P2, N1, N2 and N3 and N4 these comprise the SRAM 6T type cell then we have the these three transistors P3, P4 and P5 so their gate is commonly connected to the pre-charge signal so in the step 1 or initially the pre-charge signal is made 0 so, so its job is to charge the bit lines BL and BLB to high voltage VDD and also make sure that their voltage is exactly equal. That is why it is called as the pre-charge and equalization circuit. So when pre-charge signal is zero, then P3, P4 and P5 transistors will be on. They will pre-charge the bit lines. Also initially the SAEN which is the sense amplifier e enable signal is zero. So when it is zero, then the tail transistor uh, N5 that you can see here will be off. So this sense amplifier circuit will not work. It will only the P8 and P9 the two PMOS transistors will connect the bit line to the pre-charge circuit and they will make sure that the bit lines are pre-charged to a high voltage. In the next step what we will do is we will make the pre-charge signal to be high because the pre-charge uh, pre-charge step is already complete so we will make the pre-charge signal to be high so the pre p3 p4 and p5 will be off and we will turn on the word line so as we turn on the word line then either bl or blb will discharge so one of the bit line will discharge other bit line will remain at the high voltage vdd so as you can see the p8 and p9 transistors are also on because sense amplifier enable signal is, is still zero. So it will latch the voltage of bit line and bit line bar to the internal nodes of the sense amplifier that is the node A and node B. So then in the next step is the most critical step which is the timing of the sense amplifier enable signal to go high. So as soon as the sense amplifier enable signal goes high, the P8 and P9 transistor will be turned off and the voltage of bit line and bit line bar will be latched to the internal nodes of the sense amplifier that is A and B. So in the next step it will amplify this differential voltage and give us the output. So this is the very very simple working of a latch type sense amplifier. So it will just latch the voltages from bit line and bit line bar to the internal nodes A and B which then amplify this differential signal and produce a output either high or low depending on whether bit line or bit line bar was, was discharged. The next sense amplifier circuit is the high speed differential voltage sense amplifier. So the only difference here is that the PMOS transistors M1 and M2 are used to form a feedback loop to rapidly amplify the difference. So uh, this has a more, more speed compared to the previous circuit. So this is the only difference. 
so now let us go into the cadence virtuoso window and see the working of this latch type voltage sense amplifier so now we will see the design of the sense amplifier in cadence virtuoso so please like and share the video and subscribe the channel for more such videos on cadence virtuoso and vlsi design and on uh, sram topic uh, so your support is very very important uh, for this channel so also please share the channel with your friends so we have designed this sense amplifier using gpdk 45 nanometer in cadence also the sizing of the transistors are very important as the as the sizing of the transistors can help us to optimize the design of the sense amplifier more perfectly so let us do the transient analysis so let us check the stimuli in the first case we have the bit line bar at 0.6 volt and we have the bit line at 0.8 volt so there is a 200 millivolt difference between bit line and bit line bar so we are uh, assuming that the bit line bar has discharged whereas bit line is maintained at a high voltage so let us see the output so we can see we are getting output at a low voltage level so this is the, the output is 600 millivolt so the 200 millivolt difference between the bit line and bit line bar is converted to a output of 600 millivolt here the bit line bar was initially low and bit line was 0.8 volt so now we will see the second case also when the bit line is at a lower voltage compared to the bit line bar so now we will see the bit line at 0.6 volt and we will keep the bit line bar at 0.8 volt only so again there is a 200 millivolt difference here but the bit line is at lower voltage compared to the bit line bar in the previous case the bit line bar was at a lower voltage so we got output as low level in this case we should get output at a high level so let us see we will do the transient analysis so the sense amplifier is also works like a simple comparator because we are just comparing the voltages of bit line and bit line bar so in this case we can see that the output goes to 1.2 volt so a 200 millivolt difference between bit line bar and bit line is converted to output of 1.2 volt so the output is logic high in this case so this is so this was the video it is a sense amplifier or a or a simple comparator also that you can say so thank you again please like and share the video and subscribe the channel